I am now back to do another of these strike towers. It's the same one as before, but slightly updated for 2.0. This is the Spinotoraptor strike. All right, Spinotoraptor strike. An angry Spinotoraptor and her enraged par- Wait. An angry Spinotoraptor and her enraged parents stand between you and this strike event reward. Bring cleansing or immunity creatures to prevent damage from wounding attacks. Parents? Parents. <laughs> That's a first. Yeah, it. Uh, anyway, it's one of those uh, 200, 500 DNA uh, guaranteed incubators, as expected. And here's what we are going to expect when as we fight this strike tower. I failed to mention it. Uh, I failed to mention it before when 2.0 just came out when I did the first strike tower. Instead of showing like 1.5 times multipliers or two times whatever, Ludia has changed the math to where they just do the math for us, pretty much. So you would, and so you can anticipate how much damage they will do, the enemies will do, when they perform the attack. Now, for the case of this strike tower, this team consists of speed and bleed, speed and bleed. And that could bring so much glee if you're not cleansing or immune to them. And bulk, that too. So you, you probably need something that has obviously the cleansing that can cleanse as well as that can take, that can tank, uh, tank damage. Let's see now. Maybe something like Ankylocodon would would do well, as it has fair. It's fairly tanky, fairly bulky, and is immune to the damage over time resistant damage over time in the form of one hundred percent resistance to it. Although it's going to be problematic when you're when you pit it against Spinosaurus, since it can now destroy shields and bypass armor. And also anything that's faster can uh anything that's faster can also do well as well. Do well as well. Do well. You don't need two wells. Wooly Rhino, uh now it has a swap and stunning strike. It can slow down the enemy, although it's not fully immune to damage over time. It has 50% resistance, which means that it will lessen the damage over time that it has to endure. So yeah, I'm going to try try that one out. Try <clears throat> Wooly Reiner out. Sila Donta. Um... <coughs> How about, where is it? No, that one ain't gonna work. Hmm. Let's try the Oleko Gamma combo once more. Um, maybe distract something and Rampage and run into Woolly Rhino to, to finish the enemy off. Okay. We can try that. Hey, sauce. Okay. Oh, yeah. Myelania and Carbonemis are no longer options of taking on uh, bleeders now, 
as they lost their uh, their damage over time uh, immunity to them. So try to, you have to use an alternative to take on take on bleeders now. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm going to try Sukutair to see if something comes about. Let's we'll see what we can do with, with Sukutator. I'm very tempted to use Echo, um, as it is faster than all three of the enemy creatures, as well as it's able to cleanse and, uh, and attack. But I think I'll go with Blue, since she has more bulk uh, behind her, as well as distractions to back her up. Let's give this a try. I know not who to start with as usual, so, uh, I'm trying to remember, yeah, I don't think they have any forms of slowing, so I will use her like Ogama. And against Utah Raptor is not too bad. Although... So, okay, debilitating distraction. Here comes the high pounce. Wait, wait, what? Oh, completely immune. All right. That's helpful. Okay, finish off. Let's finish off Utah Raptor. All right, that was easy. Here comes Spino Raptor. Does it have... Okay, it doesn't have no escape, so shall I do the... Yeah, I'm gonna do the combo, the swapping combo with Wooly Rhino. <clears throat> like, even it does, even if Spinal Raptor manages to take on the stun... Yeah, I think Wooly Rhino should be okay. Oh, wait. No, wait. Uh oh. If it does distracting impact, my woolly rhino is finished. And it goes for it. Uh oh. Oh, this is not good. Um, um. Blue. I really do not want to waste the pound to finish it off, but I don't have a choice. Okay, for against Spinosaurus, right. Uh, I know can use my shields because it can destroy shields and bypass armor, so the only option is to use to spam cunning and pounce moves. And just hope for the best. But I think we have this in the bag. I think both either Alico Gamma and or Sukutator can finish off Spinosaurus. Yeah, I think we should be okay. Um. Oof. Uh, yep, blue is, blue is down. Um, yeah, we should be okay. Just a precise pounce, and that's game. Okay, Spinotoraptor, uh, Incubator, uh, Strike Tower. It's really easy, even in 2.0. Again, just use uh, creatures that are resistant to damage over time. Uh, 
and anyone that's either faster and or any creatures that have a bulky ilk that can slow down the enemy then you should be okay you should be able to win this quite easily I'm just more concerned about whatever other random contents I would get from this incubator rather than the contents that you get guaranteed. <clears throat> Spino Ta Raptor. Uh, and Inea Source is not what I was hoping for. I think I have it maxed already by DNA wise. Ain't it 500,000 plus DNA? I can't remember. Okay, thank you. Baryonyx, thank you. I've been seeing those a lot lately. Gripasuchus. I I was hoping for more. I always have. And I have a Defasaurus, pretty much. Thank you. Just need, like, what? six, Almost 600 more. 600, 700 more. Then I could start work on its hybrid. Okay, yeah, Spinoteraptor uh, boss strike. Very, very easy for you to beat. Uh, I hope this video was very helpful. And if you think so, why not you leave a like on the video? Subscribe if you like to see more. Uh, stay safe wherever you guys are at. And, uh, and, uh, and have a good one, yeah? Alright, uh, it shoots.